doesn't have any socks on. <laughs> I'll have to tell you about the first time I met Richard Norton. It was in 1978, right? Yes. Yeah, 1978. I was in Australia uh, on a movie uh, promotion tour. And so I was going to some kickboxing events around the area. And uh, I was at one kickboxing event, and Richard comes up in this, on the stage and starts doing this weapons uh, form. And I'm looking at him, he's built like this, brown as a berry with his long flowing hair. And I said, man, he looks like a Greek god up there, you know? <laughs> and uh, so anyway, after he finished the demo, I was getting ready to do a movie called The Octagon. And uh, so I said, uh, would you be interesting, uh, interested in co-starring with me in a movie? And you'd be my nemesis. And so anyway, Richard agreed, he came to the States, and we trained together for several months, and uh, wound up doing the movie together. He's the one in the mask where I kicked to the fire. That's him. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we had an incredible uh, uh, weapons uh, fight in that, in that movie, too. And, uh, and I have to say, when I, we're doing the fight scene, there's one where he sweeps me down to the ground, and I lose my sword, and he comes down with the sides. To put you know to my eyes, and so I grab the sword and I block it. So about take seven, uh, Richard throws me to the ground. I drop the sword, and I can't grab it. And he comes down with the sides, and I still got the sword uh, here. And he stops right there in front of my eyes, right there. And I go, oh, I'm glad you got control. <laughs> and, but anyway, of course, he got into a film career after that, and. Uh, you know, but uh, he has been a good friend since that time, and it's really, as you know, it's a great honor to have him here uh, giving the seminars because he's an incredible guy.